Hello, YouTube family. Today is day 21 of the crunch challenge, and I'm officially into triple digits. Today was 100 crunches, and it's also the start of my second week of school. So far, it's going pretty good. Um, surprisingly, my language class is the easiest class I'm taking. Um, I have a history research paper that I'm supposed to start looking up on. I'm not that's due later in the week and I have my women's history or not women's history, women's studies class that I'm working on and we've basically been talking about the waves of feminism and whatnot and you know where stereoty the stereotypes came from and whatnot and yeah and it's been not as bad as I thought it was going to be considering the classes I'm taking uh, I figured my language class would be the worst since I am learning a new language, but since it's a face-to-face -face class, it's not not nearly as difficult as what I fear the end results of my women's study and my history class are going to be. So, yeah. But, yeah. So, today was 100 crunches. Day 21. I have nine days left, and by the end I'm supposed to be doing, I think, 140 crunches. It's either like 135 or 140, because tomorrow is supposed to be 105 crunches. So, yeah. It's going to be fun. Oh, uh, yeah. it's My abs hurt. <laughs> they hurt really bad. So, I'm torn... For my next 30-day uh, challenge, if I want to do the 30-day beach body challenge, or if I want to do the 30-day little black dress challenge, and it's a little bit more complex than just a 30-day crunch challenge or a 30-day squat challenge, um, it involves multiple exercises to be done a day. Uh, I know both of them involve push-ups and squats and sit-ups and a whole bunch of other crazy crazy multiples on uh exercises so i'm torn um if you guys want to help me make a decision on either the 30 day beach body or the 30 day little black dress please leave a comment down below and i will pick whichever one has the most votes i know i've only got a handful of viewers right now so yay also uh Nate and I are going to be going on vacation for a couple of weeks in February, and we're going to be doing a little bit of sightseeing here, so I'm hoping to get some video of that to kind of show you guys what we're doing. I hope you all enjoyed the Sabaton video. I absolutely enjoyed going and shooting it, and so, yeah! So, also, in... There's a trip I'm planning in April. I know that's a ways away. But there's a trip I'm planning in April that uh, my daughter and I are going to take. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll get to go. Depends on how quickly our passports get back and how much it's going to cost us to fly back to the States. Now I'll go the way to that. But thank God it's the end of tax season. So <laughs> for when we're planning on going, so at least, you know, we have a little wiggle room there, but yeah, anywho, I hope y'all had a wonderful Martin Luther King weekend, um, and I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the week, and I will see you all next time!